Today I'm back, or I'm not back, I am here with a brand new league, uh, it's the FDL aka the Fantasy Draft League, uh, made by my friend Kyle, check him out in the description below, but today the Copenhagen Camera Ops, your Copenhagen Camera Ops, will be facing the uh, Cory, the uh, Banded Caterpie, with his Carolina Caterpies, I'm pretty sure uh, that's uh, what uh, he is, uh, what his team is called. Um, and uh, uh, I would uh, like to uh, go through the team that we'll be bringing uh, before uh, that, uh, before we head into the match. Uh, so I'll, I'll quickly just pull up a list. Uh, whoops! I'll quickly just. Pull up a list of um, the uh, Pokemon that I have, the Pokemon Cory has, and you know, you you guys should have probably have watched the draft, uh, my draft analysis, if uh, you haven't, because then you would know uh, my team. But my team is Mega Gardevoir, Manaphy, Skarmory, Hydreigon, Entei, Lucario, Fortress, Crobat. Uh, Sharpedo, uh, Electrive, Electivire, <laughs> Cloritza, Miss Magius, Go, Goat, and Rotom Frost. And Curry's team is Mega Altaria, Victini, Slowbro, Tyranitar, Gliscor, Roserade, Cobalion, Porygon Z, Jolteon, Meloetta, Hitmontop, Archaeops, Claydol, and <laughs> Caterpie. And the team that I will be bringing today for you guys is a very wonderful team. Starting off with what the no, it did not just do that. Okay, let me just found team again because I luckily have it backed up, so I don't have to find out what I just accidentally deleted. So let me just do that. Okay. Okay, so starting off with our Mega Gardevoir here, Bell with a uh, Pixelate ability. It's got Hyper Voice, Psychic, Hidden Power Ice, and Shadow Ball. It's uh, got that 252 in the Special Attack, 4 in the Special Defense, and 252 Timid Nature. And it's here to make sure that we outspeed, uh, or at least speed tie with Victini, because Big Teeny is a monster, and it's uh, something that uh, I do not want to underestimate. And uh, I really, I'm really scared of Big Teeny. Um, so I'm glad that uh, I've, I've, I'm ready for that. I've really prepped a lot for Big Teeny, actually. Uh, I, I feel like that's his, that's probably his main threat on the team, you know. So we got Bell here, and it's got uh, Hidden Power Ice because he has got a bunch of ice weaknesses. Um, Mega Altarior, his Tyranitar, his um, his goddamn what's it called? His goddamn uh, Gliscor, his Rose Raid. They he's just got a bunch of Archaeops, uh, Claydol, a bunch of ice type weaknesses. So that's why we 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 have Hidden Power Ice here. And we've got Shadow Ball and Psychic. Uh, Shadow Ball, of course, for the Victini and the Clay Doll. And uh, Psychic for some Stab and Hidden. Uh, no, not Hidden Power. Hyper Voice for just like a really. Just to do some. Do a lot of damage, you know? Next up, we have uh, Kilowatt, our Electivire. The Banded Electivire with Motor Drive, Wild Charge, Earthquake, Brick Break, and Ice Punch with that. Uh, 64 in the HP, 252 in the attack, 4 in the defense, and 188 in the speed. And here it will uh, outspeed a Adamant Victini, because that's really all. <laughs> I, I'm really scared of the Victini, so that's why I've prepped a lot for it. And that's it's also like it's his uh, it's his third quickest mon. He's got Cobalion, and he's got. Uh, uh, he's got Jolteon, 
that can outspeed it and then maybe Meloetta when it's like when it's changed form that and I, I don't know what the form is called but it has to use relic song song and then it'll change form and then that's actually quicker so it's technically the fourth quickest mon but is it's totally his most dangerous mon and uh, but that's if it's banded it can also be choice scarfed and then it's also really dangerous <laughs> Uh, but yeah, that's what we got here. Next up, we have our Manaphy, which is not supposed to be called Manaphy. It's supposed to call, be called Cortana, but it's whatever. Um, with uh, Choice Specs, Hydration, Scald, Ice Beam, Energy Ball, and Dazzling Gleam. 4 in the defense, uh, 252 in the attack, and 252 in the speed. Timid nature, so we're sure to at least speed tie with a uh, timid. Uh, choice banded Victini <laughs> uh, if you don't know I've prepped a lot for Victini and um, it can it can take a hit and then it can fire off a uh, choice fix scold which should be able to one hit KO it uh, depending on uh, its spread but it's like a 75% chance to Oko with scold uh, and we can outspeed it if it's adamant choice band. Next up, we have Starscream on Skarmory with Leftover Sturdy, Defog, Protect, Stealth Rock, and Roost. It's uh, physically defensive, as you can see, with 242, 48 in the HP, 252 uh, Bold Nature in the defense, and then 8 in the speed. So it just can outspeed uh, Pokemon like Hitmontop or. Uh, yeah, Hitmontop. <laughs> Uh, if it's not it, if hip on top doesn't have any investment because like it's it's always good to like just be able to outspeed those little slow moms you know <laughs> so and I didn't really know didn't really think that there was any other place that it could go next up we have Malif Maleficent our Hydreigon choice scarf levitate uh, with Draco meter dark pulse hidden power ice and U-turn this mon is here to outspeed a adamant choice scarfed uh, uh, Victini <laughs> uh, and outspeed of course like all his other mons barring choice scarf users uh, and it's got Draco Meteor, Dark Pulse, Hidden Power Ice and U-Turn uh, as you can see it's a uh, specially based mix scarf as it says here because we have U-turn as well just so we can like if we need to if we like lead with it and uh, it's not the best le lead for it we can just U-turn out into something more uh, something better you know last but not least we have our daddy the entire here with the uh, uh, life orb pressure sacred fire extreme speed iron head and stone edge it's got 252 adamant nature for in the defense and 252 in the speed. Uh, here it will. Well, I have to make it adamant to get extreme speed and has to be shiny. That's just how it is with Entai because uh, extreme speed is a um, Entei. Uh, extreme speed is uh, uh, like it's a event uh, move. It's not something that it learns uh, naturally. So that's why it has to be adamant. So it will speed tie with an adamant, for example, choice banded uh, Victini. And it can do a lot with Stone Edge. It's got Iron Head for those fairy types. It's got Extreme Speed to, for some priority. And it's got Sacred Fire for some, <laughs> just to hit really hard, you know. And I'm pretty, I'm pretty confident about this team. I know it's, <laughs> you can call it the choice the team because we've got choice scarf, choice specs, and choice band. And I honestly don't know how this uh, team will work out. Uh, I prepped a lot for Victini, as I said, because I'm really scared of that Victini. And uh, yeah, but uh, with that being said, guys, I'll jump into the match now, and uh, I'll see you there. All right, guys. Okay, so we have uh, the match here. Uh, 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 Co Corey saying good luck. And good luck to you, man. I'll also uh, say good luck. Uh, have fun um, to him. And um, okay, so we see we see his Mega Altaria. We see his 
Roserade, we see his Tita, we see his Porygon Z, we see his Meloetta, and we see his goddamn Jolteon. Now, I had actually prepped a lot for Victini, as you know. Um, so, <laughs> I don't know how this is gonna work out, but I think it's gonna work out pretty well, actually. I think we're gonna take him by storm. Uh, he's saying one sec recording taking forever to start and it's fine that's all fine but I think here well, looking looking at his um, team right here I really want to just like what what might he leave with he might leave with um, the goddamn Roserade and if he does that I would actually rather have our daddy here go in and take the Roserade uh, by Storm, but I'm not sure what he wants to lead here, because, uh, like, I think Melissa Maleficent can do uh, a lot of work to his team. Uh, just, that's that Roserade is really annoying. Um, but I think we'll lead Roserade here, and he actually leads with a T-Tar here, which is all fine on my part. Um, T-Tar being weak to bunch of good things and uh, yeah I, I guess I guess we can just u-turn here he might want to set up the stealth rocks which is fine if he does that um, so yeah let's just u-turn here we'll go into I guess we can go into kilowatt here mm, we could also just drop a Draco <laughs> No one on his team wants to take a Draco. Now that'll knock him out, but it'll 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 be so that we'll have to we'll have to uh, yeah let's let's drop a Draco let's drop a Draco we have to switch after that but oh my god okay so he's specially bulky and he does set up the stealth rocks right there so I really uh, let's just go into Star Stream yeah. We can default, we can set up our own rocks. Star Scream is just all good, you know. Power Up Punch, oh, okay. 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 I can respect that, I can respect that. Mm. The T-Tire is currently plus one, and let's see. Let's one check. Uh, if we go into, oh, hi. Dragon, oh, Melissafin, Maleficent against a Ty Ren, a Ty. Uh, let's say it's support. It is support. My Dragon Ranger does that. That looks pretty. So, yeah, he's totally. He's, he's probably uh, 252 HP, 252 special defense, and probably 4 in the attack. And he might be. 248 uh, in the HP just so he doesn't yeah and then he stealth rocks uh, we know he has uh, he might have pursuit and we know he has power up punch power power up punch and he's currently plus one so stone edge will do how much will it stone edge do power up punch well Oh yeah, it, it's the wrong Pokemon I'm looking at. Against our Star Scream, our Skarmory. Yeah, because that did that did eight point four percent. That was put four. He was plus one. Okay, so he has to be he has to have a little bit in the attack after all to do that. Um. But now that he's is that he's plus one, Stone Age will do half, but we outspeed, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, we outspeed. So let's just set up our own rocks. Let's see what he goes for. He actually goes for flamethrower. Wow. Okay, that's that's interesting. That is interesting. So I think I think we'll just Like I know we still have like he might he might have toxic spikes and spikes on his uh, on his goddamn um, uh, on his goddamn uh, Roserade, and he still have this monster. 
but I'm pretty sure let's let's see how much with will a brick rate do from a goddamn uh, kilowatt hour lick electivire great great will do won't do enough earthquake will do more earthquake depending on it's a roll to take him out but yeah let's just defog here we want to get the rocks away that's pretty dumb actually oh he actually oh okay we made a prediction there he probably predicted me to go into the, the kilowatt but I didn't so now I don't know what he might he might want let's roost let's see what he want to do what he wants to do he flamethrowers again okay okay that's cool let's just set up the stealth rocks we might go down here if he flamethrowers again nope he sets up the rocks fair enough fair enough um so yeah let's see what he does here let's just let's just scout okay he flamethrowers again that's fine um so here we can defog and live a hit should live a hit to, it's a roll i'm pretty sure but we get the rocks away so it's fine he actually earthquakes again wow so i think we can we can live a hit here we want to set up the rocks he'll probably set up the rocks again yeah might I don't know has he seen yeah, he's seen our full set now and we've seen his full set now so it's stealth rock power up punch flamethrower and earthquake I know the flamethrower was pretty uh, power up punch is pretty cool and uh, the flamethrower is also uh, it's, it's well prepped it's well prepped um, but I feel like he might stealth rocks again I know this is a bit it's a bit uh, goddamn it's a bit goddamn uh, stally right now, but that's just how it is sometimes, you know. I think he's gonna set up the stuff. Oh, he actually withdraws. Okay, nice, nice. That's cool. I can respect that. So this this monstrosity right here is probably like I want. Like, let's scout. Let's scout. Yeah. Let's scout. Let's see what he want, wants to do. We'll protect and we'll see. Oh no, he dragon dance. Okay, so he's he's physical, definitely. Let's just okay. He dragon dances again. Okay, this can be this this can be pretty risque. This is pretty risky. This is really not good now. Let's say he wants to dragon dance again. Flame throws. Ooh, okay. That's cool. So, why the dragon dance? Oh well, um, let's just... Let's just ice beam since that's our most effective move. He returns. Okay, that knocks us out, yeah. What he does. He just pixelates so he turns into a fairy. This is not good. This is not good. No, 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 no. This is not good, this is not good. Earthquake. 
earthquakes. Okay, these holes don't got earthquake. Mm. Oof. No, I'm sure. Do we outfeed this? I don't think we do. I don't think we do. And we certainly can't live. We plus two attack. Without God of War, can we? God of War. I'll bell. Against a Altaria. Mega Altaria. Uh, offensive Dragon Dance, probably. No, we can't. Plus two. Yeah, no. That knocks us out. This is not good. I think we can outspeed with this guy. Even though we're choiced. We do. We don't take it out. Hmm. Earthquake. Earthquake. Oh my god, we're gonna get six though, aren't we? Fuck. We really are. Hmm. GG. GG. Mm. I think so. Wow. <sighs> okay. Okay. Mega Altaria. We can't have let it set up. Well, GG Glory. Uh, so that was our first battle of the FDO. <sighs> we are now Copenhagen camera up to now. 0 and 1. Minus 6 score. Guys, I hope you enjoy this. Um, I don't feel like making an outro, so uh, bye.